Hi, I'm Luca and I want to give you a brief overview of our paper Netgun without GAR from random walks to low rank approximations. And this is joint work with Holger Heidrich and Ulrike von Luxburg. Netgun is a recently proposed graph generative model. This means it takes as input a single undirected unweighted graph and tries to generalize it by outputting new graphs that are different from the input graph but still share many of its topological properties like, for example, the triangle count or the degree distribution. And NetGAN does so by training a complicated GAN architecture to learn the distribution of random walks over the input graph. Once training is finished, it uses this GAN to generate a set of synthetic random walks, which are then transformed to a new graph. Now, the question that we answer in our paper is, what causes the generalization of NetGAN? because every such graph generative model needs to have some kind of bias about which graph properties it wants to preserve or what kind of graphs are considered a priori more likely. And even though the NetGAN pipeline doesn't make it explicit, it still needs to implicitly have this bias somewhere. So what we did is scrutinize every individual component of NetGAN on a conceptual level and ask whether this component can force the model to generalize. So is it the fact that graphs are reduced to random walks? Or is it the GAN itself? Or maybe the LSTM architecture that is used within the GAN? But we find that none of these components can explain why the model generalizes. Instead, we find that only a low rank approximation, which is used somewhere in between to reduce computational complexity, forces this model to generalize a graph. So after identifying this bias, we can apply this low rank approximation directly to formulate a vastly simplified graph generative model. And this new model needs no sampling anymore, it doesn't even need to train a GAN, and it runs in seconds instead of hours. If you got interested, please read, please read our paper, which we link in the comments.